Einstein wanted his theories on relativity to give us an objective understanding of reality that was relative to our everyday life. But because of the paradoxes of quantum mechanics, this never happened. In Einstein's theories on relativity, we have an effect called time dilation. The greater the energy, the slower time runs, and the greater the contraction of space-time. This fits in with our perception of time, running faster when we are interactive or interested in something. Also time seems to run slower when we are bored and not putting energy into something. It is as though the continuous flow of time and our continuous flow of conscious thought are interlinked. If we extend this idea to a person in meditation will bring his or her energy levels down. This will change the geometry of space and time. Time dilation will decrease and as time runs faster we have a decrease in length contraction of space. Space will expand and the distance between A and B will increase as time speeds up relative to the decreasing energy levels. The person meditating will experience this for what it is, the unity and oneness of one universal process, with the electromagnetic force expanding out to infinity. One of the main reasons why physics cannot explain the nature of physical reality to the same degree that the mystic can experience it is that we have no understanding of the mysterious nature of consciousness. This theory gets around this problem by dumbing down consciousness to the level of electrical activity that is aware of its own electrical potential. By doing this we can place the individual in the moment of now in the center of their own reference frame relative to this electrical activity. This personalization of the brain can give us the concept of mind with each one of us in the center of our own reference frame with our own individual view of the universe being able to look back in time in all directions at the beauty of the stars. Only by dumbing down consciousness in this way can the conscious stream of unbroken, ever-changing flow of ideas, perceptions, feelings and emotions that make up our lives be explained as the most advanced part of one universal process. This theory is based on just two simple postulates. The first postulate is that the spontaneous absorption and emission of light represented by the quantum wave particle function or probability function of quantum mechanics forms the forward passage of time itself with the future coming into existence photon by photon with each new photon electron coupling or dipole moment. The second postulate is that at the smallest scale of this process Heisenberg's uncertainty principle that is formed by the wave function is the same uncertainty we have with any future event. In this theory we have free will because the wave particle duality of light is acting like the bits or zeros and ones of a computer. This forms an interactive process continuously forming a blank canvas that we can interact with turning the possible into the actual. Thanks for watching. As an artist I'm outside the scientific community so please subscribe on YouTube, share and rate. It will help the promotion of this theory.